Howdy. I made it to Fredericksburg. It's really pretty day. Um, I made a beeline to the bathroom. Photography is the main focus. I always go shopping whenever I go to these small towns. Kind of just like meet people. You meet you meet a lot of people that way. At least I do. I would rather talk to someone in a store who runs a store than to talk to a random stranger on the street. So that's how I meet people whenever I go to these small towns. But as always, the people here are always any any small town I go to so friendly. It's so great. You can be like smiling to someone on the street and they'd be like, hi, how are you? So sweet. Okay, y'all are gonna laugh, but I'm in a quilt store. And hear me out, okay? I was gravitating towards this store because I saw a quilt outside that I might go grab because it's so cute. And they have like, so this whole room is quilts. And so I'm geeking out. But I'm also laughing at myself because I'm 25 years old. I should not be geeking out about quilts, but here I am geeking out about quilts. So all of these are so cool. I'll link this store down below. So cute. I swear, I don't know what it is. I know what it is. I am sad because I won't get to go to Charlottesville this summer. And I'm having a moment. I'm just like sad. That store really gave me the feels, man. It makes me really miss Charlottesville, which is just so funny because I'm in the middle of Texas. The people are starting to show up. Normally I go to these Texas towns on Mondays and Tuesdays, which is when all the stores are closed. A few things I want to take photos of, so I'm going to go do that. Fredericksburg will be on film. How could you not? <laughs> Um, I'll be here for a while and I will eat food before I depart, so no worries there. I will be here pretty much. Mm, planning on being here until sunset, honestly. Howdy. The majority of the vibe is, a, is drinking activities. And although, yes, I did get a slush, it's not a huge partaker in those activities. This is, this is my life. I'm sitting in front of the Fredericksburg General Store eating a pretzel with mustard with my little cup of water. Refueling. It's great. Um, I keep making friends with couples that are my parents' age just because. So I can't find a coffee shop. This is fun though. It is, it is fun. I have secured the coffee, finally. Um, by the way, it's as expensive as coffee in Beverly Hills. Kind of makes sense because you're in a town that like prioritizes alcohol over every other beverage but like still annoying that it was like a $7 coffee. But I'm putting a sweatshirt over my seat because I'm wearing a skirt and it is going to be a million degrees. I'm going to burn my hiney if I don't do this. I want y'all to see this. I just stopped for gas because my car is a gas guzzler. We love her. Look at this. Just like flat. Fueled up and ready to go. We are home. We are showered. Life is good. There's a thunderstorm brewing. I'm gonna give you a quick haul. And it smells volcano adjacent. Can't go wrong. Little tiny ones like it. I'm gonna use them for braids, like at the end of my braids. Of course they'll mismatch, but I don't really care. So. And if you don't know what napkin rings are, I will show you. Basically, put your napkin in like this. Obviously it would be a huge bigger one, but that's like that's like how you use one. And then you put it on your plate if you were like hosting. <laughs> yeah, so I got four of them. Rustic, cute, coastal vibes, right? Right, so called Vogel Orchard. Texas A&M people. They're so kind. Um, and I bought a box, which was $7. And I forget what these are called. I think they're fire peaches or firestone peaches. So I got a bucket of those. 
If you know anything about me, my favorite fruit on the entire planet of Earth are peaches. If I were to rate fruit as to like what I like eating, it'd probably be peaches, green grapes, apples, watermelon, but seedless only, blackberries. Those are my like top five. Um, so I'll catch you later. See ya.